free. I have to fake it. I leave if I could. I'm not in love, but the sex is good. You can't mistake it. Cause it's understood. I'm not in love, but the sex is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Joined by Scott from Saving Abel. What up, dude? Hanging out, ready to do a show. It's been a while. Indeed. It has been a while. It has been a while. Now, usually we can, and we've got some uh, Joe Greenwald booty action that you totally missed it. Uh, what's been going on new with Saving Gable? Because the last time I talked to you uh, was before the sex is good. Uh, this, that's how long it's been. That's a long time. The new album seemed to kind of take off kind of slow mm -hmm. compared yes. to you know, the other one. And why do you think it took so long to kind of take off the, uh, the uh, previous album? Is that our fans like sex. <laughs> Um, you know, we had the, the, the Ode to Fellatio, Addicted, that one took off and put us on the map. Right. Then we came out with one about Stupid Girl, which was a little too introspective. It wasn't about Stupid Girls. Right. It was about not moving to Hollywood for the wrong reasons and trying to keep, you know, your morals about you while right. having fun. Precisely. And it's about Marilyn Monroe, but it was a little too deep, I think, sometimes. Or, you know, sometimes songs just don't connect. So we went back to what worked for us, which was sex. And the sex is good has been doing really well for us, and we're starting to move some units. And hopefully we'll get about four or five more singles out of this one. Very cool. Now, you're on the road with Hinder for a while bunch. Uh, I've, I've had many parties with them. They hung out at X-Best and May Days. And, um, and in Kopech, who we met earlier today, they were in the studio. They're a great group of guys. And now, I've never met Mike Darkest Days, but they kind of have that, that look like they might also be... I, 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 I do you keep your wits about you on this tour? You don't. There's a, a lot of these bands that I know are some of the wilder bands out on the road these days. Let me, let me just sum it up by saying this. The way this tour has gone, it's literally we show up in your city, we take over your city, and we right. leave. It's been unbelievable. It's like Bad Boys of Rock Tour. Uh, right. You know, but you know, we've got that wholesome element. You know, you just saw Jared with his child and wife. Right. Here. So we're trying to maintain that delicate balance of rock and roll hedonism, hedonism and uh, family values. Yeah, you can't say hedonism and child things. <laughs> Look, the good news is, uh, is that his one-year-old daughter won't be joining us at the bar after the game. No, and we will be going to the bar. We will going to hang out, aren't we? We will. And it's been a long time. In fact, I, I, you've been to my house before, my old house. I have. Way back in the day. I wasn't there, though. I heard you use my toilet. That was it. Best one ever. <laughs> Scott from Save Angle, oh, man, I appreciate you taking a couple of minutes to talk to us. Can you maybe give us a little insight what maybe is going to be the next single? expect from you. We are talking about putting Miss America out there. Okay. Because one, it's the title track, and two, ultimately, it's, you know, we just love the military. And, uh, I'm not sure if we wanted to still be at war when we, uh, when we you know, had 18 days coming, but we are still at war, so right. we want to make sure we support our troops. We've actually been over there to uh, yeah. Iraq, Qatar, Kuwait, um, and we're going to go back again this summer. Like, there you go. Miss America, everybody keeps telling me my girlfriend was like, she's the one filming this. It's a compliment. She's gorgeous. I know. I said, hey, she's almost as pretty as my girlfriend. You want to turn the camera on yourself? No, I'm no? She, hates okay. <laughs> she hates the camera and the microphone. So there you go. Scott, I appreciate it, man. My pleasure. Congratulations on another successful album, and uh, they'll be on stage if you're not here. Sorry about your luck, but hopefully we'll have them back around in town, and maybe you'll see us out drinking. Word. Word, brother. Thank you. Oh, I'm so far.